Hello and welcome back. This is Nick again with Live 365 and in this third video we're going to go over how to set up your microphone and using Skype with your live broadcast. So the first thing you really want to do before going live is setting up your microphone. And it's actually really easy to do. All you have to do is go down here to the mic fader and click on the little gear icon. And there's going to be this drop down menu that shows all the different options that you have available to you on your computer. Now in my case, I'm using the Blue Yeti stereo microphone, which is a great microphone. But in your case, you might have a different mic or you might be using an external mixer with several mics plugged in. So you just want to select the correct uh, audio device you're using and then you're good to go. Next, you want to go ahead and click on the mute button here to unmute. And as soon as you see those meters popping up, that means that your mic is working. So after you have your mic working, all you pretty much have to do is click on the on air button in the top left corner, and that's gonna start your live broadcast. Before we do that though, I'm gonna show you how to set up Skype. Okay, so to set up Skype is actually really easy. Just click launch down here. This is gonna trigger your Skype to open. Go ahead and log into your account. Okay, and once it's open, go to Skype, go to Preferences, go to Audio Video. In this window, just select for Speakers, Soundflower 2 Channel. Once that is set, Skype is ready to go. Now I can start my live broadcast. Just click On Air. And once you see this uh, On Air button go red and the timer start, you're live on the air. So that pretty much wraps it up for Studio 365 Live for Mac. I hope you guys enjoyed the videos. If you have questions, make sure to contact our support team. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel, and we'll see you real soon.